Newsom is digging deeper into those local IRS workers who were called to speak with congressional investigators. Nine on your side's Jason Law has more on one former Cincinnati IRS worker in particular. Her name came up during a congressional hearing today. Jason? That's right, Carolyn Clyde. The House Oversight Committee requested five IRS workers be in Washington next week to give interviews on what they know about the last couple of years. It's not hard to keep your exempt status. Today it was revealed in the congressional hearing that Holly Patz, seen here in this IRS online training video, was at one time an IRS manager right here in Cincinnati. Now she's currently the director of the Office of Rulings and Agreements for the IRS in Washington, D.C. But according to J. Russell George, the Treasury Department's Inspector General for Tax Administration, and the guy who headed the scathing IRS audit that came out earlier this week, he says Holly Patz was a manager here in Cincinnati at the IRS office when a lot of these problems took place. Located in Cincinnati, there were a number of people, a director named Holly Patz, P-A-Z. Um, she was the acting director for a significant period of time that this was occurring. And then there were various management techni technical unit managers and the like. And I could supply a full listing of those names at your request. That is my request, and I would formally request that. Now, FEC records show that Pats donated $4,000 to then candidate for president Barack Obama's campaign in 2008. There are no records of political donations for the other four Cincinnati IRS workers called to be interviewed by Congress next week. Carol. All right, thanks, Jason. Word.